Hello guys and welcome to the weekly asset roundup with me, Pug Gaming. Now firstly my apologies for the lack of video last week, it's been a very busy week at work but we're back, we're playing catch up, what better than to look over the last two weeks, beautiful assets. Let's do this. And to kick things off this week we have these beautiful parking lot roads by Baddy Ear. Bad idea, I guess. Now this custom road has really made a big difference on the workshop and to people's creations. You can really establish a great parking lot now and you can do so so much quicker and easier. Up next we have Jez with these French flats and my word, are they beautiful. Certainly this one here on the right hand side, they just look super super cute and they do look absolutely fantastic. The chimneys on top, the detail, the textures, everything is spot on and I really do love these. It's really making me want to build a Paris area build. From Paris to Great Britain, we have the UK Terrace of Six by Paul J. Chris. Now these are buildings that I see regularly in my local area. These are outstanding. And they also have the ability to have cars parking on the drives, which is a lot more realistic now compared to everyone parking on the road. So that's a superb addition that's really gonna make a lot of difference to realism. Now I'm sure you've seen a lot of Back to Bricks new assets and this is the latest one, it's a corner flower shop with the actual flower assets that really do make this asset pop. And you know I'm a big fan of buildings that aren't just 2x4, 4x2 etc. This has got a bit of a shape to it and it's great for adding into your city. Nighttime view as well, spectacular. And of course, it's not an asset roundup without a King Leno item. And this is the Link Main Casino, a very modern looking building, very unique and will really make a big shine in your city wherever you place it. Details, as always, top notch. We always look forward to more from this man. Also this week,
I'm sure you've already seen the return of P. Delmo. The Tree King has returned and these tiny planter trees work absolutely beautifully on their own or why not combine them with Armesto's recent release of the Planters Prop Pack which are absolutely outstanding. So these can also be raised up and down as well so you really have a great customizable options to be used with these. The King of Glass has returned and this is the data mining agency from Senfcon. Now we're all great aspires to having some very nice and unique buildings and this one in particular is certainly a very nice modern and very unusual looking building but one that can really really excel your city. Fantastic work as always from Senfcon. Jumping back into the Paris theme, we have the Paris Residential Pack here from Fine Build. Now these are sensational. If you haven't seen the other buildings that he's already done, you need to check those out because these are just additional ones to those. And my word, are they fantastic. Such unique shapes and you can really have fun jigsawing these all together. But don't forget, it's not just the daytime look views that look amazing. Look at these nighttime shots. We've spoken about the return of P. Delmo, but the return of the Train King is Beswiegelhausen with an absolutely mammoth amount of props. Now I had trouble getting them all down into one shot, but these are a majority list of them. If you want to check them all out, check out the four different prop packs he has. There's one for generic freight trains, one for intermodule freight trains, locomotive props one and two as well, but my word. This must have taken him a long, long time and I don't think we're gonna to need to have any more props for trains for quite some time. So what you're waiting for, get those into your builds now. So guys, that brings us to the end of this week's Asset Roundup. As always, please leave your comments below. Let the creators know your thoughts on their models and give inspiration for new ideas and what you'd like to see next on the workshop. But as for me, thank you very much for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe and like the video if you did so. Until next time, all the best.